across the U.S. people planning to view Monday's solar eclipse, but residents in some areas may have a better seat for that show, and that includes Paducah, Kentucky. News 2's Corey Johnson joins us with the details on how one business there is preparing for this. Corey? That's right, Mark. Parts of Paducah, Kentucky will just see the total eclipse compared to other areas. So the McCracken County Co-op Extension is taking advantage of their positioning. Officials with the co-op have taken to social media to invite people to a watch party that's set to kick off on Monday from 11 a.m. until 3. Now they've ordered a limited supply of special glasses to help protect your eyes, but you are welcome to bring your own to the event as well. In addition to the solar eclipse, there will also be fun activities for the family, food Food trucks, so everyone of every age is welcome to go. Now I spoke with Mary Dossett who helped to organize that event. She tells me they have received several calls of interest for the event th so far this week. I think it's kind of a once in a lifetime event. Um, we've had people from different states, all in different counties in Kentucky too, reach out to us and they're all super excited about the event and it's definitely going to be very interesting to see it. Dossett tells me officials are expecting around 500 people to show up to that event. Now for more details on McCracken County Co-op Extension and how you can participate on Monday, make sure to look for this story on our website, WKRN.com. Now coming up on News 2 at 4, details on how one Murfreesboro library is also planning to educate kids about the eclipse before they get to see it. Mark? Yep, three days away. Corey, thank you. Well, some schools already made the big announcement to keep the kids home on the day of the eclipse. So Rutherford County, they're going to use one of their stockpile days to keep the students home. They made that call due to the eclipse happening so close to dismissal time. Rutherford County picks up and drops off more than 250,000 students on its buses every day. Now, Stewart County also going to close for the day on the eclipse day. They said they want as many of the community members to enjoy that day in a safe way. Metro Nashville Public Schools, however, will be in class on Monday.